minister of God, pastor, evangelist, apostle. We are the ones that have been called to change the world, to transform the world, to save souls from sin and bring them to righteousness, to save God's people from satanic traps, lies, homosexuality, sexual immorality, abortion, abort, abortions and, and darkness and evil and sin, and bring them to God's kingdom. Therefore, I have a piece of advice for you. Pastor, evangelist, anointed man of God, anointed woman of God. And this is my advice. Stand and teach as Jesus taught. Get a topic and say, today we are going to learn about overcoming homosexuality overcoming unrighteousness, overcoming sin, or we are going to study about living right with God. We are going to study the, um, um, we are going to study about a certain topic. Because if we hide truth from the world, we are killing truth. For instance, why did I start to say this? I was watching the view at a friend's place. And there's one of his celebrities. He's called, I won't mention his name. He's not even a celebrity, but he's a news anchor. And he's a handsome man that we grew up watching on TV. And everybody admires this man. He got married this last weekend to a man. And all these news people are praising the marriage. I'm so happy. I witnessed this. It was amazing. It was good. And our children are watching. Meaning that there's somebody who has been fighting the sin of homosexuality. But now he's going to be comfortable and say, wait a minute. If somebody did it. A rich man, a handsome man did it in church. I'm going to also do it. This wedding took place in a church. What are we supposed to do? We as have big churches and mega churches. We are not going to stand and just prophesy. We are going to stand and say, ladies and gentlemen, sin is sinful. And where they sin, there is death. Whereas they, where they sin, there is curses. God hates sin. We cannot continue sinning. As Charles Stanley preached, let's preach as that. Billy Graham, Matthew, John Hagee, some pastors that I've, I've been really, really watching. And I'm saying, guys, especially we, I'm going to be honest, the African community, why do we hide and cover ourselves in sin? A day is coming when you will leave this body and you will go to the Father. There's going to be an angel at the gate and there's going to be the Savior Jesus himself at the gate. And he's going to tell you this. Every Sunday I used to come to your church, but you never preached about homosexuality. You never told people how sin is bad. You never told people to repent. You never told people fruit of the spirit. And he will say, away from me, evildoers, Matthew 7. You say, I'm anointed. He will say, no, away from me, evildoers. Ladies and gentlemen, there is another life. You are enjoying the jets. We are enjoying the money. We are enjoying the fame. We are enjoying the anointing. The lame are walking, the blind are seeing. But there is a day when you're going to leave this body. Where is your soul going to be? Are you going to be in a good, another life? Jesus loves you.